I'm Leah. Good morning, Bears. It's going to be a terrific day. We're reporting live from RH Studio. Today is Wednesday, May 17th. It is the 162nd day of school. The time is 7.52. Hi, I'm Owen. Please pause and join us in the moment of silence. Okay. No, we never did that. Please stand and join us to say the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Now to Anna with our birthday report. Hi. Now back to Leah with breaking news. It is almost the end of the school year. The last day to check out books from the library is this Friday. Good luck to the fifth graders taking the, S the math SOL this morning. Be aware of the quiet zone. Now back to Ohm with more breaking news. You might want to check out the lost and found. There are many jackets, sweatshirts, and other items that may belong to you. Here are a pair of pink glasses with small yellow bees on the side. Remember to bring in canned goods for the food drive this week. Now back to Anna with more breaking news. On this day in 1970, baseball legend Hank Aaron becomes the ninth player to get 3,000 hits. Now to our fourth grade meteorologist for today's forecast. Good morning. This is meteorologist Parker reporting from Mrs. Parker's room, reporting with the weather report. Today we're expecting to have a mostly sunny day. The chance of precipitation is 10%. The high temperature today will be around 92 degrees. Be prepared to wear shorts and a short sleeve shirt when you go outside today. Thank you. Our Bear Pass students today are Christian and Miss Owens' class. Woo! Awesome job! Kendall and Miss Workman's class. Really a nice one. Emma and Miss Groff's class. Woo! Great job. Awesome job! Mackenzie and Miss Child's class. Woo! Congratulations! Sanai in Miss Holler's class. Woohoo! Owen oh, Ayat in Miss Eisenhower's class. Nice yeah. job! Same. 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 Well, hey, Roundhill Bears, it's your principal here. Yes, I know it's not Friday. That, you know, hold your horses. I know it feels like a Friday outside because it's going to be like 95 degrees. It's going to be crazy. So, speaking of hot and sunny, I have some cold and snowy news for you. Yes, yes, yes. We had another great snowman contest, right? And there for a while, I know that we thought that the great snowman contest was not going to happen. Right, Anna? Yeah. There for a while, it looked pretty sad, like uh, we were going to actually be making snowmen out of crafts and things. I know the third grade, in, in, uh, they, they entered a couple snowmen before the real snow came of some very creative uh, STEM creations. But it turned out we ended up having one of the biggest uh, number of snowmen that we've ever had. And it's time to announce our winner. And uh, it, I'm going to give a shout out to our winners. And I'm going to see if maybe you can recognize and get a hint about uh, who won this one. All right, are you watching? Those of you that submitted a snowman. All right, you ready? Watch closely. It's going to happen quick. Ready? Did you catch it? Did you catch that? All right, let me show you. Here it is. The winner of this year's Great American Snowman Contest is right here, and it's Zeke Zane. Is that right? Zeke Zane, Zoe, and Ezekiel Martinez. Xavier. Yeah, Xavier Martinez, uh, Zeke, and Zoe are all students here, and the little one is not quite here at Round Hill Bear yet, but he, he will be. So congratulations to these guys. They will receive free yearbooks. So congratulations to everybody that entered into the snowman contest. It was kind of fun to wait to a 95-degree day to announce the snowman contest. So, <laughs> boys and girls, have a great day. Fifth graders, you guys are going to do awesome. I know it. You're ready. Please join us to recite our daily...
three R's? Responsible, respectful, and ready to learn. Have a wonderful Wednesday. Remember, manners matter.